Hey guys, and welcome to the first part of today's episodes of Let's Play Mega Man Zero Four. Okay, last time we had just finished off the rest of the main eight bosses, and we had killed off Kraft. Oops. Not really. I mean, not like Kraft really had any plot importance to the plot, aside from, what, robosexuality between him and Nage? Oh yeah, I don't think I finished that the last time. It's like, unless you've watched like um, somewhat later episodes of Futurama, you probably won't know what that is. And you can look it up; it's easy. <laughs> In order to send the transporter coordinates, you're going to have to disable the base's protection. You can disable it by pulling all of the switches at the end of each of the hallways. One thing I do, I need to look around search up because I forgot exactly where I have what enemies are called what and give like you know certain data chips because I need to make well I don't need to make the recipes for double jumping but it is extremely useful get out of here because the second stage that's coming up double jump is actually pretty useful specifically one part where you have to jump on. It's like in the first Mega Man Zero game where you have like the um, boxes that kind of like have um, electricity that comes out in different... No, 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 no! Ah, damn it. I hate that. Not so much for getting full health there. Anyways, um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, like in Mega Man, the first Mega Man Zero game, where you have the boxes that will shock you, and it goes in like a pat. Oops! Don't wanna get hit? There we go. So yeah, they like shock you, and some of them, are, one or two of them, are hidden like off to the side of the screen. So you're kind of like making blind leaps of faith hoping that you don't land on the side of it or on the top of it when it's shot well. Mostly the side of it. If you land on the top, you can at least grab onto the sides if you're falling off, but hit the top and like you're kind of screwed. I mean the side and you're kind of screwed to fall down to your death. Ooh. Hey baby. Alright, I'm getting some energy from my sub-tank. Sub-tank or sub-tanks? Okay, just sub-tank. One of them is full. Uh, I wish they would allow you to, I don't know, throw something in so you can just, I don't know, change your weapon equipment in like the middle of the game instead of having to go back and forth to the menus. But I know it's a Game Boy Advance game, so... Obviously. That's not something I think that Game Boy Advance has the ability to do. I mean, I could be wrong, but... Man, whatever. <sighs> Keep going through these hallways. It just seems like... I don't know, they kind of ran out of ideas on what to do for this stage. I mean, all you have to do is... Go through all four hallways, then go back to the beginning, and there's the boss. Oh yeah, one thing I wanted to tell you guys is, um... I've been thinking a lot recently about re- Aw, dang it. About redoing some of my older projects. Like, specifically the... Like, older Mega Man X game. Well, yeah. Redoing Maverick Hunter X, and... Out of here. Maverick Hunter X, then doing the original Mega Man X. Redo it. Probably redo X2 and 3. I will redo 4, only because I don't know what it is about. Wow. I don't know what it is about X4, but I just love it. My favorite game in Super. <sighs> well, actually, that's not bad. Well, I mean, not bad is the fact that I just popped his door. Uh, of course, I could go through and get no health and 
have that big thing of health up here and not go towards my sub tank. Unless you want to be a doll and give me some. Can you be a doll? Uh, oh, I want to be a prick. You're going to be a prick to me, huh? Nope. Nothing new either. Love you guys too. I have been anyways. Definitely going to redo some of my some of the older Mega Man game, well Mega Man X games. I might actually get around to doing the original games, although I would never do not hold me to that one. <laughs> I am so bad at the original Mega Man games. I mean, I'm not horrible, but Ooh. Ooh, there we go. Yes, there we go. That's good. I'm not horrible at the Mega Man, the original Mega Man games. It's just I'm not very good at that. No, who damn? I hate that. Uh, let's see. I would laugh if it's still there, but I doubt it. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I hate how it does that. The text bubble pops up on the bottom of the screen once you pull every chip. And every time it does that, you can't get your whatever you drop. Well, whatever they dropped. No help. There we go. There. Now I forgive you. Why do I keep trying to pick them up? I already filled up my sub tank. My sub tanks. My sub tanks. Oh, wait a second. This boss is really just. I don't know, this boss and the boss in the next level are just jokes. <laughs> Using the ice javelin on this boss and the next boss are really good since it hits multiple times with them. Of course, I can do well enough to get hit by everything. And it's going to go in again. Come on. Are you not going to bounce around this time? I saw myself getting hit there for sure. Yeah, watch out for those things. If they do pop up on you, they will hurt you. I mean, it's not a lot of damage. It's like any other enemy just walking into them. Gotcha. Because I've got to make you go out in style. Well, I've got to go out in style. I just made you look cooler when I killed you. Inputting coordinates. Done. Now you can reach Ragnarok, so get back here ASAP. Okay, CL. I'm coming back, and then... Oh, thanks to you, we've secured access to the teleporter circuit. We still have to bypass the protection surrounding Ragnarok, but I've got an idea. Let's continue with the next mission when you're ready. Let's go ahead and start this so we can get the dialogue out of the way and I can ramble on as we run through the stage. Using the teleporter base, we can transfer you to Ragnarok, but you'll have to disable the protection around Ragnarok on your own. How do I do that? I can help there. Whenever we transfer you somewhere, we transform you into a program data and send you over a circuit. I can modify the transfer program to allow you to move freely inside of the circuit. It superimposes visuals on the circuit so you can tell what's going on. That way you can navigate from the teleporter base to Ragnarok via something akin to cyberspace. If you head towards the end of the circuit, you should be able to directly disable the protection program. Oops. Oh, my bad. <laughs> I didn't mean to skip it, I act um I saw 
I don't know, I thought it was saying this mission, I accidentally pressed the button to skip, it's like, oh, oopsie. You need to read it, just, you know, pause the video there. So this is the inside of the teleporter circuit. It looks a lot like cyberspace. Zero, come in. The circuit leads to Ragnarok. It looks like the enemy is there too. Destroy the protection program up ahead. <gasps> um... Oh yeah. Also, since I'm going to be redoing those, um... What do you call it? Um... Like Mega Man X... Like, pretty much all of the old Mega Man X games before... That I did before 5. Okay, come on, get out of my way! Damn! Like trying to move and you keep jumping in there. Well, I guess that's probably what you're supposed to be doing there. Good jump again. Ooh, don't you dare! I don't want any laser, I want health from you. Ow. I'm being good. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Taking damage? Well, that's no biggie. Because you're, you know, me! You don't die, you just... I don't know. I'm sure you're not good at avoiding this shtick. Let's see, oh yeah! I'll go back to it. Um, but if you went down, you can actually... get a, um... item recipe. Well, not an item recipe, but... One of the sort of rare parts for recipes that you need. Let's do yeah, let's let's Well eh. I don't feel like going to get it right now. Because if I die, I don't wanna start back. Basically just go down that first hole we saw and make sort of a jump over to the whatchamacallit. Yeah, it's just like a open um, sort of platform in the middle of the area, so just like jump forward and play. Gotta be careful. Get out of here. Oh god. Got you before you could do anything. Uh, this is the part I hate. That I want double jump on. I mean, this... Like, first part is easy. It's one of the platforms that kind of like a blind leap. Oh, come on, get up here. You're going to follow me and really fuck me over. Oof. No, come on! Damn it, I hate that! You're like mid-air before you can actually tell it's happening. <sighs> you know, it pisses me off. It's like, okay, I don't mind getting hit, but can you make it so it's not just really out there and no one can tell where they're going? Uh, no! Get out of here! Grab on! Ooh, go away! <laughs> oh god! Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Okay, there. Just <laughs> go get hit by something before you jump to that one. Ow. Come on, that's what Oh, no health for me. Oh, aren't you useful? Okay, put the ice the ice javelin on again. Because again, this is one of those bosses where it's actually really useful. You know, with the multiple hits thing. This is the protection program. Beep, beep. Circuit intrusion detected. Protection activated. Eliminating intruder. Let's see. Come after me. Oh, I forgot about this one. That's one I didn't remember. I completely forgot about. Of course I... Wow. Okay. All I have to do 
is. <sighs> of course, in my case, you'll just jump right into them. Woo! This is the easy thing, just jump around. <laughs> I'm cheating. I don't want to use my sub tank. Damn it. Just trying to get around to him. Oh, you're kidding! You prick. I shot at the worst time so you don't get hit by him twice. Ah, I'm so good. Hey, I'm oh, I'm a perfect edge? That's... I think that's a step down from Supreme Warrior, though. Protection has been disabled. You can head to Ragnarok any time now. Zero, hurry back. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Um... Oh, wh why am I... S damn it! <laughs> Sorry about that. I was thinking to myself about something and just kind of started reading in my head and skipping. You can't fail. The world is counting on you. And make sure you come back, okay? Alright. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's the last... It's the last area. Oh, you know what that means. Fight bosses. And that's it! Oh, wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. Shoot, I can't remember if this is actually the first episode for the day or so. Wait, is it? Oh yeah, this is the first episode for Friday. Okay, well then... I don't know, I guess maybe this will be the only thing that goes up today, and then... The last two episodes will go up on Saturday. Or I could do... Eh, yeah, I'll just do the last two episodes on Saturday, so... Yeah, we're gonna end off today's episode here, and I guess this is it for today, and you guys get the last two episodes tomorrow. And then, you know, we get to focus mainly on Phantasy Star Zero, and then on the weekends will be Mega Man ZX. I'm so excited for that one. But anyways, I'm rambling. So let me get off here, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.